China's first cargo spacecraft, Tianzhou-1, docked three times with the Tiangong-2 space lab and carried out three in-orbit liquid propellant transfers. The first docking took about two days. The second involved a fly-around to dock with Tiangong-2's opposite port. As the first cargo spacecraft for China's space station construction phase, Tianzhou-2 can deliver up to 6.9 tons of payload. It completed four docking and four separation operations with the space station's core module, including rear docking, front docking, robotic arm-assisted docking, and Taikonaut-controlled manual docking. Tianzhou-3 completed its rendezvous and docking in just 6.5 hours, faster than Tianzhou-2's previous eight hours. Following the Tianzhou-4, the Tianzhou-5 cargo spacecraft docked with China Space Station about two hours after launch, breaking a world record. A mini-satellite named Macau Student Science Satellite 1 was released into orbit by the Tianzhou-5 cargo spacecraft on December 18, 2022. Tianzhou-6 is the first in China's upgraded series of cargo spacecraft, which includes models from Tianzhou-6 to Tianzhou-11. Its cargo capacity increased from 6.9 to 7.4 tons, with an expanded cargo compartment, growing from 18.1 to 22.5 cubic meters. Tianzhou-7 completed China's first optimal three-hour fast rendezvous and docking with the space station. Tianzhou-8 carried about six tons of supplies, including special lunar soil bricks and fruit flies, helping scientists design future moon bases and study how life adapts to space's low gravity and magnetic fields. It took about three hours from launch in Hainan for Tianzhou-8 to dock with China's space station. And so did the newly launched Tianzhou-9, setting the new norm for resupply missions.